I was in prison for three years, nine months, and 14 days. I was on the chain gang about 18 months. The worst part of the chain gang. Getting on your knees and jagged rocks and letting them put chains on your ankles. I can't think of anything more demeaning or humiliating. They committed to crime. So they're gonna have to suffer. They're gonna come out and do a day's work. You're looking at the nation's first ever female chain gang. I'm elected by the people, I serve the people, and I will do what the people of this county want their sheriff to do. Let's face it, the chain is uh, something that the public likes. We, we're doing something right now that, that, that's already been outlawed in this country. You know what I'm saying? It's already been outlawed in this country and every other country around chain gang. They've been outlawed. Quite frankly, we think the whole practice is barbaric. It's pure torture, nothing less, nothing more. Only message of chain gangs right to gave them up that, that the system doesn't care. And they put them through pure hell on the chain gang. If you're convicted, you should be punished for your crime. You can talk about rehabilitation, education, evidently it hasn't worked. The chain gang, it had an impact on me. But after I got off of it, the impact was lost. It was lost. It changed me. I feel like it made me worse. I feel like it created within me the idea that I should just continue to be bad. Gang gang number two. Available now on video on demand.